It's the last day of Gulf Coast Jam, and it's been a record year for the festival. But there was shock in the crowd last night when Jason Aldean was not able to perform. This is the second time his Gulf Coast Jam performance has been cut short. News 13's Erica Orstad tells us what his fans think about the sudden cancellation. He was the reason that I came to the festival, and then he's not playing again, so I'm very disappointed. Jason Jernigan is one of hundreds with a similar reaction. I'm a little upset. I'm upset. After Jason Aldean's headlining performance at Gulf Coast Jam was canceled on Saturday night due to a stomach virus. Jernigan says he knew something was up after Low Cash's performance ended. We didn't really notice anything until after they went off the stage. Immediately following the performance, executive producer Randy Lovelady came on stage to address the crowd. He's been throwing up. We've had the doctors here all day, and he's been extremely sick. His uh, tour manager came to me and said, we, we tried. I mean, this is, we, we literally found out literally minutes before we announced to the stage that, uh, that he was going to have to cancel. And I truly am sorry if people are upset, but the reality is it was out of our hands. It's out of Jason's hands. Aldine apologizing in a video and in a tweet, saying he hopes to be back as soon as he can. But amidst the disappointment, many are wishing the country singer a speedy recovery. We know what he's going through. I hope he gets better. Take it easy, Jason. We love you. We love you. I'm hoping that I get the opportunity to see him again. Despite the sudden cancellation, this year's festival saw record numbers, bringing heavy tourism to the area and country fans from all over. Erica Orstad, News 13, Panhandle Strong.